So this is going to be a glam look, okay? We got rhinestones here. We got sparkles. So let's just get dressed. Let's get dressed. It's going to be a long video. So I've been going back and forth to see which complexion item I want to use. I don't know if I want to go in with the Vanessa Myrick's Yummy Skin Tint because I've been liking it a lot lately. Or stick with my girl long because I know that this is very long lasting and it's going to make my skin look hella smooth. This is good too, but it's giving more of like a dewy effect. I think we're gonna go for girl on today. Okay, so the concert doesn't start until, it says eight o'clock, but everybody's been saying it starts at like 9.30 when the sun goes down. It's now two o'clock, let's say it's two o'clock. Why my mom called talking about she is gonna be ready. I'm like, okay, I'll leave the house at five. She was like, no, that's too late. I'm like, girl, where are we driving to? We literally are driving 20 minutes down the street, but she said it's going to be traffic and we got to wait in line and all that good stuff. So <laughs> here we are. So I'm leaving my house to meet her at four. So we have two hours to get dressed. I mean, while we're here, might as well try some new stuff too. Right? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> All right, so that was one pump of foundation. I need to put some lip balm on. My lips are dry. All right, I'm gonna go on with my Dior lip oil. This is clear, just to put that on while we get dressed. Sure. We're going to be putting on the Lancome Tiny Doll Concealer. So they recently reformulated it. I don't know what the change was. I'm sorry. Um, but it's the All Over Concealer. I love this concealer. The original formula is over here too. But this is the new formula. I don't want to get them mixed up. So I have two shades, 500 and 460. I'm going to go in with 500 just to conceal my under eyes. Because as you can see, I have this dark shadow that we're going to cover. I'm going to zoom in a little bit as well. So... This is 500. I use a lot of concealer, so here we are. I'm gonna put a little bit in the T zone too. I'm so excited. So we don't have floor seats, but we're on the lower level, 100. So I got tickets the first day it came out for the Beehive pre-sale, thank God, amen. Got our seats and yeah. So it's me and my mom and my sister. We're going to the concert today. All of my friends are going too. So in our area, we have two concerts. Most of them are going, but we all go in different days. You're in different section, you know, that's how it is. <laughs> Alrighty, so uh, now we're gonna go in with the lighter color. This is the 460 to highlight. And this one I'm gonna have set a little bit. But as you can see, the concealer has pretty good coverage. I don't know if I wanna go brighter than this. Probably. I have a new powder too that I wanna try. Hmm. All right, we'll just leave it like this and then we'll use the powder to brighten. All right, what am I wearing? I'm wearing a champagne sequence dress and the makeup and accessories, hot pink and gold. So Renaissance Barbie, Renaissance Barbie. That's what we're doing. Okay, let me grab the new stuff while I have this set. I should probably do a haul video because I have so much makeup here. As you can see, I did not film in the month of July. It's August. Um, but yeah, it's fine. <laughs> so 
So let's grab the new makeup. So the powder I want to use is the Danessa Myricks Evolution Powder. It's in the shade pink to brighten the under eye area, but the blush is now. Why did I buy all these hot pink blushes? Like literally in the same transaction. They were all in my cart at the same time. I don't know if the vibes were there, but I was just like, I want pink blush. So that's where we are. So this I bought like two months back. This is the Juvia's Place Blush Liquid Blush. It's literally called Barbie Rose. So that's that pink. I should probably get my earrings to see what kind of pink they are. I think it's more of a blue, blue tone pink. Then I have the new Valentino Liqui Rosso. This one looks like that. That is a matte color. It's called Pink is Punk. So this is more of a blue tone pink. You can see, and then that's like a, a true hot pink. Then we have the Makeup Forever blush. This one is the Artist Blush in Daring Candy. That one looks like this. I feel like that one is giving the vibes. And then we have the Patrick Ta um, new color. So this is the Double Take Cream and Powder Blush. You guys know that I love this formula. So I already know how this formula works. It's just a new color. So maybe I should try a new formula in today's video. And this one is called She's Given. And it looks like that. Ooh. Patrick. Ooh. Okay, let me go grab my earrings. And then we'll decide which color we'll go for. Alright, I'm back. So the concealer is still sitting. Um, but those are the earrings. They're from Amazon. So I think... The blue tone pinks will probably work better, right? Mm, I'm thinking of makeup forever. Yeah. Makeup forever. That's probably going to work the best right now. So we'll do that today. We'll try the rest. I promise. We'll try the rest. Alrighty. So let me blend this out. So this is my dress. So as you can see, it's like a champagne-y sparkle. Um, kind of pinky, but it's champagne. Um, it's a low v-neck collared dress. So this is what we're wearing. Um, I'll try to get a picture and insert it in here, but it has like ruching on the side. Um, yeah, that's me. <laughs> If you hear any noise, it's literally my portable fan that I have right here beside me because these lights are bright and hot. Alrighty, let's bronze. Going in with Laguna Bronzer, the cream, number four. Evolution powder in pink from Danessa Myricks. Auntie Danessa, we love her. So the pink is pretty pale. Let's see. You can always add another powder if we don't like the tone. But you know, everybody has pink powders now. We have who has pink powders? Um, one size Danessa Myricks. Huda. Dior had a pink powder, but we'll see. All right, I'm using my little puff. Okay. Wow, it is so fine. It does not even look like I have powder on. I mean, it's brightening, but it's not.
shaky. You know what I mean. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to press that in because I want this under eye set, okay? Beautiful. I like that. Hold up. Hold up. I hope it doesn't have flashback, but I like it. Okay, pink powder. Is this what we doing? Hmm. Not mad at it. I'm going to go in with my Dior Cushion Powder. I cut a hole in there because it's almost done. <laughs> I was going to buy a new one and I was like, okay, let's be real. You have so many powders. Use those powders first. So that's what we're doing. We're not wasting product. Even though I love this powder, as you guys know. But I'm trying to use my stuff. Okay, beautiful, all set. I want a little bit more matte because we are going to be dancing, we're gonna be moving, so I just need this to stay on all day, especially because it's pretty early right now. So it is a little bit more matte than I typically go for. So let's go in with the NARS, no, do I wanna do NARS? Yeah, let's do the NARS. NARS bronzer in Laguna 7. Just for a little bit more warmth. To the hairline. Perfect. And okay, we're gonna go in with the blush. We're gonna be trying out the new formula of the Artist Blush from Makeup Forever. I like that they put them in palettes. Um, normally, they sell them in pans and then you get the palette for like a dollar with it. Um, but I think this is a little bit more consumer friendly and people will just gravitate to picking it up once they see it in a compact, you know? So you still can like refill it, open this up and refill the pan, but I do like that they did that. So yeah, it's makeup forever. Again, the shade is Daring Pink. Yes. This is a number 50 brush from Sephora. What song am I singing in my head right now when I put this blush on? Bad bitches. To the. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, I like this formula. She's hot. Pink. Okay. Yes, pink. Okay, my face is smooth. Ooh, look at that. This little blush is going right here in the everyday stash right there. I like it. All right, I'm going to do my brows off camera, and then I'll get my eyeshadow situated, and I'll show you what we're going to be doing, because we're putting all right stuff. It's going to be a little thing, so let's get situated, and I'll come back, and I'll show you everything else I like. Alrighty, I'm back. I have my brows on. I used my Gucci Stylus for Sales Brown Pencil in Noir. It's my favorite in the Refi, Refi, Refi Brow Gel. Y'all know what I'm talking about. So today we're going to be going in with Pat McGrath Utopian Dream because if it's the vibes, okay? If it's the vibes. So we're going to go in with the neutral colors, of course, to give us a bit of bill, but I think I'm also going to be going in with the blush as well just to um incorporate that pink into the eye look as well so yeah i'm not gonna be talking a lot because i gotta go so we're just gonna be doing makeup for my eye look though i'm gonna be using majority rougher brushes today i'll leave them down below if i remember i'll leave them down below i'll try to edit this pretty soon so
Okay, so we're definitely using this topper shade right here. Um, but, but I want to incorporate a little bit more pink on the lid. Go on with this one right here. All right, we're going to go with the topper. Sparkles. Yes, yes, yes. And then this one right here in the inner corner. Right, those. Okay, just gonna take a minute. So I'm just going in with like different variations of the pink rhinestones. I'm putting some in my crease right now and then I'm gonna like scatter a couple over here. So I'll come back and I'll show you guys what that This is my makeup. Here we are, we're rhinestoned out. I'll put some mascara on. For my lip, I have on Chestnut Liner with Sephora Collection Matte Lipstick number 21. And then some gloss I'm going to put on Pat McGrath Earth Angel. I'm going to bring my powder puff with me. guys so this is my finished look i like how it turned out i'm gonna have some fun so i'll see you guys in the next video bye queen i come true move out the way i'm with my girls space queen i come true move out the way i'm with my girls and we all need space when the queen, queen comes through flat like the red say move out the way it's a home run when the team touch pitch. Yeah. Tip, tip, tip on the hardwood floors. Tip, tip, tip across the floor. Give me face, face, face.